Hi guys, how are you? Okay, so I just filmed this really long video, it's like a haul video, but my I didn't realize that my TV was blasting in the background. Uh, actually, I filmed this earlier in the day when I had natural lighting, but I have this really weird setting up right here, like there's a lamp right over this, just because the lighting in my apartment is seriously terrible. And um, so I just wanted to show you guys a few things that I picked up. Um, yeah. Here's the first thing. They're the Jeffrey Campbell 99 ties that I told you guys about in my pre-haul. I love these so much. They're so comfortable. I got them in a size 7. I'm normally a size 6.5 or a 7, but I heard that Jeffrey Campbell runs a little bit small, so I just picked them up in a 7, and they're perfect. I haven't worn them out yet, but I will soon. And they came in this cute little box. But, um, yeah, so... I got those from Urban Outfitters for $62.99. Can you believe that? I could not believe it. I was so excited and then I made a video for you guys and they weren't even on sale anymore. They're normally $150. So yeah, that's an awesome deal pretty much. And then the other pair of shoes I got from Urban Outfitters are these riding boots. I have been on a mission to find just plain black riding boots that actually fit a short person for probably like two years now, I always settle on something I don't love, but I think I really love these. <laughs> um, it was funny, I called my mom when I saw this sale, because these were $59, and I was like, Mom, I found boots! And she's like, you found boots? And then uh, you could hear my dad in the background, she's like, Victoria found boots that fit a short person. So, I love those here, it is one last time, they have just like little buckle detailing. It's by the brand, um, Ecote? Eco I don't know how to say it. I think it's Ecote, <laughs> but yeah, I love them. Okay, so I'm going to show you guys what I got from Cotton On first. I just got some plain black leggings. I don't really need to show you guys these very much, but yeah, these were $10. I figured I love leggings in the fall because they're comfortable with boots and big sweaters, so you can't have too many of those. And then also from Cotton On, I don't normally go to Cotton On because I never even really heard of it until I moved to SoCal, but so I never like remembered to go there when I'm at the mall, but this time I went and I got this like really slouchy um, baseball, I guess, baseball style tee, except the sleeves don't aren't three quarters. It's just, it's really cute. It has a high-low hem, it's size small, but it's really big. I'm going to have to shrink it, but this was on sale for $10, so that thought that was a good deal. And then, um, if you purchase that day, or I don't know how it works, but that day when I was there, they said that you can pick out a scarf or a beanie for $5, so I just got this, like, olive green, um, circle scarf, which I really love already. I just got it the other day, and I'm wearing it already. <laughs> and, um, next I'm going to show you what I got from Glint and Gleam, or Shop Lately. Okay, I got this rose gold watch. It has spikes on the sides. How cute is this? It's rose gold, and um, they have it in gold, silver, and I think hematite. But I am so in love with this watch, and I made sure to go get it resized right after I got it, because I have this problem where I'll buy watches, and then I won't get it resized, and then I never wear them, which is stupid. So, yeah, it fits nicely, and I love it. So cute. And um, I've been really into rose gold lately, so I got this little... Um, cubic zirconia ring from Shop Lately also. Um, I just love this. It's perfect. It goes really well with my um, rose gold diamond ring that Evan got me a few years ago. No, it's not an engagement ring. Some people get confused with the, <laughs> the how the video works because I don't know. I think it's like flipped on some people's computer, but this is my right hand. It's just a little promise ring. So the next things I got are from H&M. Of course, I went ahead and got this same sweater that I have in black and teal in this like bright coral or pink, I don't know what it is. I just love this sweater. I can't get enough of it, obviously. Now I have three. Um, here's the, it has a little zipper in the back, and it's just like the perfect sweater for fall. Is this like oxblood, I guess, oxblood colored skirt with a zipper going down the front. It was only $7 at H&M. Um, it's just like a bodycon skirt. 
I haven't gotten a bodycon skirt in a really long time, so I kind of wanted to get one since I never wear them. But this is really cute, it's such a great deal, and the fabric is quite thick, so um, I thought it was really worth $7. And yeah, I tried it on this way by accident. Um, but I think the zipper goes in the front because that's the tags and the other side. So, yep, this is super cute. I've been trying to like get lots of bottoms, different bottoms than I normally get because I don't know. My bottoms are too boring. There's always like jeans and just plain leggings. So I also got these. I'm obsessed with these. They're like liquid leggings. They're a really soft material, but do you see how there's like this really subtle floral print? Love, 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 love. <laughs> this looks really cute with the the bright like pink sweater or coral. I don't even know what color that is. Okay, next is the stuff I got from Forever 21. In my last haul, I told you guys that I was on a mission to find some faux leather paneled leggings, and I kind of found some. It has um, I don't remember what this is called. Um, like a it's just going down the sides. But yeah, these are so cute, um, very thick and nice, but bad thing about them, after one day of wearing them, uh, they're starting to pill big time on the back already. I don't know if it's because I sit in a fabric chair at work, but I was just kind of disappointed about that, but I'm still going to wear them because I wear huge sweaters over them, so yeah, these are cute. These were $17.80. Oh yeah, the leggings from H&M. These crazy ones were $25, which to me is kind of overpriced, but um, I like them a lot, so. <laughs> um, okay, next is this giant sweater that I got from Forever 21. I love this sweater. I thought that I grabbed the size small, because I know I tried on a medium and a small, and the small fit the best, and then I realized I grabbed the wrong one. This is a medium. I knew, I knew there was something like different about it. It felt like bigger than the other one. But I still, I've already worn this twice already. <laughs> I wore it on Thanksgiving, but yeah, and there's buttons going all along the back, which I love. So cute. So next is the other things I got from Forever 21. Oh my god. I was on a mission to find a faux leather skirt that's like kind of pleated and flowy. On my way to find this skirt, which by the way was $14.50, that's such a great deal, I saw this skirt. Hello, this is like the cutest thing ever. <laughs> that was really obnoxious of me, but I am so obsessed with this cute little floral skirt. I love it. But um, yeah, so this is pretty much perfect, and I got this for $17.80. And yep, I got the iPhone 5. Sorry, I'm so excited. This is my first iPhone, and I'm such an Apple girl that I don't know why I've never had one. But and I got this like floral case. I just got it from one of the wholesale stores that I shop at. Um, I might possibly start, we might sell it at the store, but I don't know. So yeah, if you guys like to see quick little things that I buy, I usually post it on Instagram first, so you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram, at Vicky Loves Clothes, and I'll see you guys later. Bye!